A driver trying to get away gets stuck instead. I'm Stephen Luke and here's what's up. A Chevy Camaro crashed into a retaining wall in Allied Gardens. The driver was trying to get away from San Diego police, but he's now in custody. Officers were chasing the car from Interstate 15 when suddenly it crashed into a family's minivan and almost ended up in their yard. Two security cameras, one inside the garage and one outside, captured a brazen Bay Park burglary. With a garage door opener taken from a car parked outside, two men stole bikes, sports equipment and power tools. The suspects even made two trips just a few hours apart. The homeowner's advice? Take your garage door opener inside your house with your keys. If you bought one of those water bottles at Costco, you've probably already gotten a letter telling you it's been recalled. Contigo has already recalled those Contigo Kids cleanable water bottles because the water bottle's clear silicone spout can detach, posing a choking hazard to children. And dockless scooter crashes are not new, like this one in downtown last year. The riders here weren't sighted, but they were seriously injured. Now, a new study is looking at the helmet, drug, and alcohol use in these crashes. Approximately half of the 100 or so crashes studied involved someone riding under the influence, and no helmet was used in nearly all of the crashes. You can read more about what the study found on NBC7.com. Hi there, I'm meteorologist Sheena Parveen. For tonight, it'll be pretty mild outside, but comfortable. Tomorrow, though, as we head into your Labor Day weekend, it's going to heat up, especially for our inland valleys, our foothills and mountains, but expect plenty of sunshine. Make sure you have the SPF 30 or higher. Have a great day.